Okay, so this week, Israel entered another round of elections, which means that the next three, four months are gonna be filled with arguments and conflicts this way and that way. But is anything good gonna come out of these conflicts? Are we gonna look back in a few years and say, wow, the world became a better place because of this round of elections? See, it's not that Judaism is against conflicts and arguments. You open up any page in the Talmud, it's filled with differences of opinions this way and that way, but yet we still study them today and they help make the world a better place. What's the difference? Jewish wisdom in this week's Torah portion teaches us difference is how you approach conflict. Are both sides in search for truth or for power? When you're in search for truth, even the side that loses wins because truth was revealed. But when you're in search for power, like in this week's Torah portion for Korach, the tribe of Reuven, the firstborns, they all felt that they deserved to be the leaders. So then nothing comes out of that conflict. Unlike the conflict of the rabbis of the Talmud, we still study them today. Shabbat Shalom from Yerushalayim.